Hey guys, this is Zaman from PowerPoint School and today I will show you how to make this animated text in just PowerPoint. But before starting out today's tutorial, let me tell you that PowerPoint School is now on Patreon. So you can become our sponsor and that will help me to create more free contents for YouTube. I'll provide the Patreon page link in the description of this video. So without wasting any further time, let's start out today's tutorial. Here I have already taken a blank slide. So first, pick a text box, drag it over here, add some text. Here I am using the Montserrat Extra Bold font. I'll increase the font size to 88 point. Place it here to make a duplicate holding the control shift, drag it to down and it will be duplicated. Then add some other text. I will select only this word and I'll change the font color to this. Holding the Ctrl Shift, drag this text box to down and it will be duplicated. Change the text. Then selecting all these text boxes, place them in the middle of our slide. Now I will pick a oval shape. Holding the Ctrl Shift, drag it over here, make it a small circle. Then go to Format, from Shape Fill, make it black. From Shape Outline, select No Outline. Now I need to add a pencil icon which I have already created in PowerPoint. But to save your time, I'll just copy that icon from my previous slide and here selecting this icon, press Ctrl C to copy and press Ctrl V to paste. You can create this pencil icon using some basic shapes of PowerPoint. It is really easy to create or just download this template file. There you will have this icon. Now let's move forward to our next part. We need to pick a line shape. Holding the shift key from your keyboard, drag it from left to right, then go to format, click on this format shape icon here under the line option. We need to increase the width 4 point, change the cap type round and join type round, change the color to black, then just close this option. After that, place this line shape in a way so that it looks like that this line is drawn with this pencil. Then right click on this line shape and select send to back. Then holding the control button select this two press control G to group this pencil and the line shape. After that to hide some part of our slide pick a rectangle shape. Drag it over here in this way. Then go to format from shape fill. Change its color to white so that it matches with the background color from shape outline select no outline. Holding the control shift from your keyboard drag this particular rectangle from left to right so that we have another copy of it. Then what I'll do, resize its size from this side. Then select this group of pencil and the line shape. Right click on it and select bring to front. So we are done with creating all the necessary elements. Now we have to add the animation in a way so that our works look like this. So without wasting any further time, let's start adding the animation. Go to animation tab, click on animation pane. From here, we can look over our animation status. To add the first animation, select this group. From add animation, select fly in. From effect option, select from right. Keep this on click, set the duration to second. Click on this drop down arrow, go to effect option, increase the smooth end, then press OK. Then select this first text box to add the animation from add animation select fly in from effect option select from left set a start with previous duration one second delay one second click on this drop down arrow go to effect option increase the smooth end press ok select this second text box from add animation select fly in again from effect option select from left Set a start with previous duration 1 second and increase the delay 0.25 second more. Click on this drop down arrow, go to effect option, in increase the smooth end again, press OK. Select the last text box, do the same from add animation, select fly in. From effect option, select from left, set a start with previous duration 1 second, increase the delay 0.25 second more. Go to effect option, increase the smooth end and press OK. Now what I'll do, select this circle. From add animation, select zoom, set start after previous, duration 0.25 second 
and we are done. Now if you start the slideshow, you can see our animation is working perfectly. As always, you can download this template for free. I'll provide the download link in the description. And please check out our Patreon page. Your support will help me to upload more amazing free contents in YouTube. For our Patreon sponsors, there are so many rewards that I am providing. Our Patreon page link is in the description of this video. And a special thank to those who have already become our sponsor. So that's all from this video. See you in the next one. And thanks for watching.